industry, and here's what we know. When you hold a phone up all to your ear, Hello, I'm Dr. Deborah Davis. I want to welcome you to environmentalhealthtrust.org. In this website, you will find lots of information distilled from the state of the art of science that tells you what you need to know so that you can live a safer and healthier life. Among the things that you will find on our website is information on asbestos. Asbestos, we know, is a hazard, but many people are not aware that it can be found in more than 35 million American addicts right now, not labeled as asbestos, in the form of zonalite. On the website, you can find links to YouTube videos of the entire expert meeting that was recently convened in Washington, D.C., with scientists from more than a dozen countries, and those scientists all reported on the latest findings that cell phone radiation can actually damage the DNA of our brain cells and can alter the signaling that's going on in the brain. We don't really know what the long-term consequences will be, but studies done in the Scandinavian countries where phones have been used the longest find a doubling, or worse, of brain tumors in people who have used cell phones for a decade or longer. In fact, recent reports are that children that start to use cell phones heavily in their teens have four to six times more brain cancer by the time they reach their late 30s. We also provide information on practical things you can do in your home to clean your home, to take care of yourselves and your families using fewer toxic materials for cleaning products and using safer materials on your bodies. Thank you. I'm Dr. Deborah Davis.